And away we go. Tyler Sneed took a kick back 100 yards the last time he touched it against USF. But this time he gets out to just the 18. Now let's go make some plays with my legs tonight. Ritter will throw it on first down, and he'll throw it deep. And it is batted in the air and picked off. Intercepted. That is Daniel Charles. And he had him. It's 101 the outside. Alec Pierce, your big 6'3, 212, gets on top. Great job getting on top of the DB right there. Just ball is underthrown. Allows the ball to get popped up in the air. In the interception, that's a great way to get this thing going for ECU defense. Great concentration. Made look at that. Looks like he secured the catch on the interception. That was Jaquan McMillan that popped it in the air on the coverage. And Let's here's another look. See if he controls. The ball seems to be controlled now. Yeah, I think that's a catch. Now remember, Ritter is still young. He's just a sophomore. This is Warren. Great to see him back and great to see him in the open if you're Cincinnati. Inside the 30, inside the 25. Second and goal. Warren in. Touchdown, Cincinnati. And Rich, that was all Michael Warren right there. That's leg strength. Downhill, it's a stalemate at the line of scrimmage. It is, and ECU may have actually won that, recreating the, uh, recreating the line of scrimmage. Assistant and defensive coordinator, done a wonderful job here. Ayers going deep. Johnson has it. Johnson's in the clear. Race for the end zone. Touchdown, ECU. 75 yards. Take your shot indeed. Oh, they took their shot. That was like Santa Claus with a little present down the chimney right there. What an absolute dime. And I asked this coaching staff yesterday, are you going to take some shots? These DBs for Cincinnati struggle with go balls on the outside. They struggle locating and they struggle with deep speed down the field. They're like, yeah, we're going to take some shots. We have to. Why not? Great job by C.J. Johnson. This is their first year here with East Carolina. Desmond Ritter goes to work, fires it down the sideline, got a man there, caught by DeGuara. DeGuara, the tight end, racing, and he lands at the one-yard line. He is a terrific tight end, and that's a big play. Right here, just a corner route. The defense loses him. We call this Tampa Bay. You had a little stop route, flat route. All you're doing is reading the flat defender. They jump on the two shorter routes. You hit the tight end over the top. And that's some speed right there from the big man. He kind of looked like a receiver. Dokes in the game now. And Dokes Wildcat. is going to take a direct snap and a direct dive into the end zone. And Cincinnati answers quickly after the 74-yard throw to DeGuara. Dokes is in. Little Wildcat action. Dokes had a big game. Last time out, three total touchdowns. Coaching staff said he's kind of getting back to his old form where you saw a couple. Second down, 10. Blitz comes. Ehlers. To his right, fires it wide open as Cole, who makes the catch and has a first down. Timing on the throw. On first and ten, again, he pulls it, fires to the sideline. That's Hatfield, breaks a tackle up the sideline, inside the ten, and down to the six. From the six, third and goal. Blitz comes, Ehlers steps through it. He can scramble, racing for the corner, and he is in. Touchdown. Line. Look at the pickup right here. Great job. Allows the quarterback to go through all of his reads. No one's open down the field. And we talked about that first or second. Warren, that's a big hole, and that man can run. And he's going to the 30, Warren to the 20, and down at the 18-yard line. Another gaping hole and another big run for Michael Warren. Direct snap. Warren straight ahead. Picks a hole, and he's in. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Three first quarter touchdowns for Luke Fickle's offense. 
And big play after big play. Center Robinson does a great job. One-on-one -on -one with the nose tackle. Locking him out just enough for Michael Warren to get in there for the touchdown. These two teams have combined these on the drive. Eight penalties already in the game. Ayler's in trouble. Hit as he throws. Got it, man. It's caught there. That's Johnson. Bryant on the coverage. Especially on corner routes. Ayler's quick throw. Touchdown. It's better. Should be Zach Bird. You get a little play action. Great job dipping right under the defender. The last thing you need right there. Wednesday night to say hello. And man, that's a great story. Literally waiting at the door. Another deep shot there, and it's caught by Hatfield in Cincinnati territory. A freshman. Let's that's get... a little fist pump somewhere. <laughs> Ailers again, lots of time. Middle shot on the money and caught at the 14. Hatfield. Get him the foot off your screen. Ehlers rolls that way. Throws that way. Caught! Hatfield again! And the Pirates take the lead. Is the Hatfield coming out drive? A couple big catches, and hey, we're going to reward you with a nice little touchdown. C.J. Johnson does a great job. It's a pick route, a rub route, as the offense wants to say, of not putting his hands on the defender. Just go up, square up, and force the guy covering. You have those two timeouts in their back pocket. Ritter, time over the middle. Oh, and it's picked off! Intercepted by East Carolina. Second pick of the night for Ritter. And once again, Ritter's just late. You see him hitch, and that's the third hitch. See it and let it rip. Daniel Charles on the 27. If you throw that ball a half a second earlier, that's a completion to DeGuara across the middle of the field. All right, let's see if ECU takes shots here. Ehlers steps into this one, fires it up the sideline, back shoulder. Back there. That's Johnson. What a catch. And a first down at the 15-yard line. 27-yard attempt. Kick is up and good. And how about this? East Carolina, and now there's a second on the clock right now. East Ritter pulls it, keeps it, and across the 40, slides at the 48-yard line. Good start. Just keep that in your pocket. Oh, Ritter's got a lot of room in front of him. Breaks a tackle, 20, 15, 10, and he's down inside the five-yard line. Price hauls him down. And going left side, Warren stops and bursts into the end zone. Touchdown, Cincinnati. A statement of a first drive to open this second half. Great blocking on the outside. Moji on the outside, number eight. Tight ends are doing a great job, number 82. They've had success. It's been a go-to, a staple right now inside the five-yard. From the nine, here comes the blitz. And it looks like they're all coming. Ehlers, there's the corner. Touchdown to Sneed. Littlest man on the field with a big catch. And ECU stretches the lead. He loves that corner route. Need one on one inside leverage. We talk about that little wiggle. It's all alone. Johnson in motion. They throw it towards him and it's incomplete. Someone got a hand on it and Cincinnati stops the two point conversion. Dokes with Ritter to throw it. Corner caught. Touchdown. DeGuara. And there's your six points, Aaron Murray. And probably the most competitive and confident throw that we've seen from Desmond Ritter. You see, one, two, three, doesn't waste time with hitching. Understands we're in the red. Third and six. Ailers. Oh, it's picked off! That's Gardner! And he's going! Gardner to the 10! Cincinnati has the lead! Quickly it 
changes. <laughs> it is absolutely amazing. Great job by Gardner. Understanding where the sticks are, anticipating the ball is going to come out now. And he just he guessed it perfectly. That's the perfect time to jump a route. Great job. And we talk about this defense field. Ready to throw. Got it. DeGuara. Pick six and a two-point conversion and a three-point lead. Number. If he can tie it. High snap. Kick is up. Kick is good. 43 apiece. Snap. And the kick is good. And Cincinnati escapes. Exhale. Number 17 survives on the road in the American. What an ending and what a feeling for Sam Croson.